Hello again and welcome to Paul's Racing Channel and to the Ultimate Racing League. This is round six from Autodroma Nationale Monza in Italy. This is uh, race two. This is reverse grid and this is how it looks going into this one. So Jerry in pole position, Alex in second, Paul in third, Moz fourth, Chuck in fifth, Molson sixth, Love Rocket in seventh, Dyson eighth, Chand in ninth, Flash in tenth, NC 11th, Thomas 12th, Grasshopper 13th, and Wadru in 14th. Let's watch those lights, and away we go. Remember, there's a stop in this one. So it's going to be a mix of hards and mediums here as Paul goes on the outside of both Jerry and Alex, and I think he takes the lead as Paul he does. And then the rest, look at this going down. Chuck almost out on there, someone's out, there is someone out on the grass, there was Flash actually, just ran it a bit wide, easy done there, if you run it too wide as they all come through, all pile through, oh Jerry's off, there's a big moment now, and that's going to be, oh it's a reset, the two full GT's, got to be a safety car, got to be, as Chuck waits, so presumably he, Something must have happened there, and there's someone else off that was Grasshopper. And there's another, and Chuck, oh, and I think Grasshopper was in the way of Chuck, and I don't know, see it, just see the back end of that one. So it's got to be a safety car, surely. Well, at the moment it's not, as we see our leader Paul going through Ascari, and they're all racing still. So maybe. Well, there's no safety car called. I'm surprised. I'm surprised after the first one there was no safety car called, but it wasn't. So Love Rocket up to third place. And Moz again is full, so the AMGs are still together. And then Thomas finding out with Chand in fifth and sixth place. Wadru in seventh. Then Molson eighth, NC ninth, Dyson tenth. Jerry in 11th, Flash in 12th. Flash just trying to warm up his tyres. Must have been, after that off, must have had a bit of dirt on him. He was the one that ran wide here, down here. On lap one. And then Grasshopper in 13th with Chuck in 14th. Got tangled up with Grasshopper there. Grasshopper went wide and I think he had nowhere to go, Chuck. That's what I'm guessing anyway. So, Chuck in the wars again. As Paul continues up front. Oh, one's a bit wide there. And Alex, looking better this time round. In second place. A rocket third, Thomas, and then the rest of them streaming through. Look at this lot. Moz, Wadru, Molson, Incy. Shot as they come up here, look at this as they come up to Ascari. Oh, great shot! So fly through there now down to the Parabolica. See if Jerry can have a better race here this time. Oh, runs wide right there, Jerry. Just trying to put the power down a bit too quick. And uh, just runs a bit wide. Fortunately, didn't lose too much time. Molson all over the back of Moz with NC close behind as well. It's going to happen here between these three up at the chicane. Well, since he's going up the inside of both of them. Oh, and there's some dramas up ahead here, I think. Between Thomas and Chand. There's Wadru as well in there. So still really close between these lot. I think a lot of these guys 
Well, as, as I say, mix of mediums and hearts, really. Medium for Chan. And then heart for Wadru. There's Moz going up the outside of NC. Molson behind them. Now, can Moz have a go at NC? Too far back there, I fancy. Right, this is going to be one of those races. It's going to be close and personal all the way through. Oh, Moz now. Good run through there, but I think it is just going to have a little bit more pace in that Supra to keep ahead of him. He does. Oh, Molson's having a little sniff around behind these two, though. Just biding his time, waiting for that moment. Obviously still early doors in the race, so no, no reason to go silly yet. As Jerry and Flash are side by side, Jerry attacking him. No, didn't get that done, so Slips just drops in behind him. Again, nice dice in the head of them. Now, what about Dyson here? Can he get past Flash? Flash having a look at Dyson. Oh. oh, runs out now. Was that a touch? Not sure, but Flash. Oh, might just run it wide. Did well to control that. Almost lost it. They kept it on the black stuff. So the two four GTs together. Scotland against Ireland here. Grasshopper back there in 13th place on his own. And Chuck, he's been off again, I think. He's having a terrible race, too. Just whatever it is, and again runs wide. Has he got an issue with the car? We see this, didn't we, last time out? He seemed to get it resolved, but maybe something's come back there, or is it? Due to the off, who knows? He's back there. Doesn't really sound right either, does it? That NSX. Right, back of our leader, Paul. Half a second penalty there. And Alex still kind of keeping with him in second place. So, a better showing for him. And then Chand up to third, and there's a moment here, and what was that? Who hit that? Not sure. I think that might have been Inzi taking Chand. Been a few incidents at that chicane, but Thomas and Molson and the rest don't count. Thomas right up behind Inzi now. Or was it just Inzi getting involved in the spin that Chand done? I don't know whether there was a, a touch there or not. There's someone on the outside, that's Alex. He's at a moment. He drops all the way down. Oh, Chan's there as well. And was that a result of Alex being there? I'm not sure. But, oh, it's all very messy back there. Grasshopper's going to go through. Alex can't get the car straightened up. Chan and Alex both getting it away there. Not too sure if there's any hand signals being given to each other there. I'm not sure. Didn't see any anything obvious through the cockpit. But Chand drops in behind Alex in the 13th with Chuck in 14th. It's all a bit messy back there. But look at this battle. Oh, and again, some touching up here and Dyson involved. Flash, Incy. Incy's uh, in the walls a bit here as well. And ahead of them is Molson attacking Moz with Thomas in third. So look at this, Molson is going to surely go up the inside. It's going to be on the outside unless he can get it done before then. Moss is going to stick it out on the outside. Don't want to run it out wide though. Oh, not onto the grass. So Moss still in. I was going to say prime position, but Molson done it. 
Rogue lights up, Molson gets fourth place, Moles fifth. Flash on the back of these now in sixth. And then in Steve Dyson. Jerry. Wadru. Wadru? Hang on. Yes, you heard me all right. Wadru in tenth. What's happened now? So he must have had a moment. Or either that. Or a fairly big penalty. They've all streamed past him, but he's back to tenth. It is what it is. My goodness me, he's already on the attack though. Over Jerry. Can he get him done here? I think he has already. He has. So Wadrill to ninth, up to ninth then. Head of him in Dyson. Let's bow here, look at this. It's not so easy, is it? Moss drops in to Dyson, up to seventh. Moss drops in behind him into eighth. Oh, and now he runs wide, does Dyson. That's going to allow Moz a chance again. No. Just ran it wide, did Dyson now. Right, and who's that going in? I think that's one of the Supras, it's in seat. So he's going in early. Ten minute mark just after for his stop. Remember, can't uh, pit lane will close in the last ten minutes as Wadra attacks. The inside of Moss now right up behind Dyson. Oh, and what's going to happen here? No, so still Wadra in seventh. Slowed it down, slowed Moss down as well in the process. Jerry's fancies a bit of this too. Here he is there, number 11. in 10th, still ahead of Alex in 11th. Well, these two just trying to get back on, up to speed. I think really they've lost that momentum. And even with the stop, I think they're gonna to be too far behind to, to get anything done. In seat in 12th, remember, he, he did come in, so he's the first one who came in to change. He's down to 12th, but did that work to his advantage? Coming in early-ish. We'll see. Paul Steele, our leader at the moment, by quite a big gap actually. Love Rocket up to second, so he's doing well. Of course, these haven't stopped yet. But he's doing well with the hard tyres, is Love Rocket. Alex having a good race, he was up to that moment when he something happened, whatever it was, dropped himself all the way back, so. Disaster for Alex again here in race two. There's Thomas in third, Flash in fourth. It's all still very close up here. Molson, whoa, big moment from Molson. Again, great catch. Audrey behind him in seventh. Lots of lag going on there. Great battle up here, there's Dyson, fifth place. So 13 and a bit minutes in. It's almost halfway mark now, here in race two. As we see Jerry. Trying to get close to Moz ahead of him. Yeah, no one else has come in yet. Oh, just as I say that, Thomas is in. Oh, they're all swimming in now. Wadru, Moz, Molson. So quite a few coming in now. Or Chan come in as well. I reckon he will. I think he might stay out. Yeah, he's staying out to the left. Along with Alex. And see, we know he's coming in. Grass up in 13 still. And he's been in. Chuck. 
Looks like he's also been in. So the boys at the back there have done their stop. Paul, meanwhile, he hasn't, and he's gonna continue to increase the lead at the front. But of course, he's on the mediums. So it's whether them hards can, what will the hards do? I was gonna say, will they last? They certainly last, but what can they do? Obviously, you're not gonna be as quick. Is he gonna have enough in that, in the last quarter of the race, depending on when he comes in the course, um, to hold off the competition? Obviously knowing that you've still got fast guys behind him, or everyone behind him at the moment. So as we see him come through the power biker, no, it still stays out. Above Rocket then, second place. He'll definitely be in here. Fuel is low, not gonna have another lap in that. So in he comes now, here he goes, right on cue. Flash gonna stay out, Dyson's in. So Flash up to third now. He's gonna have another lap of it. Love Rockets in, Dyson's in, Jerry's in, Chand. He's staying out as well, he's gonna have another one. Alex is in by the looks of it, he is. So there will be boys going in. And we're gonna be coming out on the mediums. Medium guys are staying out. So we watch Chan. It's the sun just going down now. Getting a bit late in the day. Still, the crowds are here, enjoying the action. So in seat. He was the first one that came in and he's up to fourth, so maybe, maybe this will pay off. So he's made his way to fourth place with Thomas in fifth, Love Rocket in sixth. So it's all about what can Incy do here? Being that first one to come in after 10 minutes. He's on their medium ties. Got no problem with Tyres going off, Paul's in our leader, so Paul's coming in. Now we should see, start to see the medium, the top three on the mediums going in this lap. Paul's already in. So Incy now just coming through Ascari, coming down to the Parabolica now as he timed this right. Let's have a look, see where he comes out here. Yeah, flashes in, and I think you'll probably see Chan going in as well, I would imagine. Pulls out, so he hasn't done pull, Incy, but he's coming around a parabolica now. Yeah, Chan's in, so he's definitely going to take that second spot. Thomas close behind in what will be third place. There he goes. So now it's all about what the tyres can do, hard tyres can do for this second stint for Paul and Co. Now Incy there in second, Thomas in third place. Incy with that fastest lap, a 139.902. Love Rocket there, oh, a second penalty for him. Track limits, presumably, somewhere. And then Wadru behind him, so, looks like Wadru and Molson, who's close behind, could take that fourth and fifth spot once uh, Love Rocket takes his penalty. We've got Dyson, got Flash, 7th, 8th, and then Moz in 9th, Grasshopper up to 10th, and there's Jerry in 11th, been pretty settled there, there's Jerry in 11th place, Chand in 12th, Alex 13th, oh, runs wide, Chuck still in 14th place. Just seeing this one out now is Chuck. I'm intrigued to see how the mediums are going to be doing here. Well, it certainly looks like 
Thomas is catching in C, certainly on that shot as well. In fact, there they all come, streaming round across the start and finish. So, what can NC do with 10 minutes left? Can he hold off Thomas? Can he get that second place? Which, to be honest, it'd be a good result, won't it? If you can get a second place. The strategy almost worked, in the sense that he nearly got to the top. Paul's still a little way ahead of him, but I think they're closing in. Oh, wide from NC, gets himself out on those dirty rubber bits out there on the left. Don't want to be out there too much. That's going to allow Thomas just to close that gap a little bit. Wadru coming through. This is where we're going to see Wadru and Thomas, I think. Show him what they're made of. With the alien skins that they have. What can they do? Can they win this race? Can they get themselves up into the top spots? Ten minutes is, uh, is clearly possible. Olsen doing well as well in fifth place and Love Rocket there in sixth. So again, just comfortable as you like for Love Rocket. Consistent. Can't really say much more than that. Can't really do much more than that, really. It's a great car, the AMG. Great all-rounder. Thomas not really gaining on him. See, well, he is, but slowly, slowly. Catchy monkey. Zinzi trying to get away from Thomas best he can. Been a good job at the minute. Thomas is slowly piling on that pressure. And all the time, look like they're catching Paul as well as he comes up out towards Ascari now. Exit that now, heads on down to the Parabolica. Gap basically back to Incy and Thomas. Yeah, Thomas visibly closer now on the back of him. I think it's just a matter of time before Thomas gets that second off him. All the time he's getting closer, he's getting that slip as well. The advantage of that coming into play. And Wadru as well, he's just beginning to show his hand. Not literally, but okay, his headlights, let's put it that way. Hasn't really got near them either on that car, has he? But here he comes. Oh, one in the battle between Molson and Love Rocket. Love Rocket having a little sniff there, seeing if he can get up into fifth place. Didn't quite make it happen. So just sticks behind Molson now in sixth place. Dyson just, uh, again, just slowly Getting closer to them. Grasshopper and eight flashing ninth. Back here though, Thomas is on the back of Incy now. And when I said it was just a matter of time, this could be the time. And there's Paul just going around the paper block, definitely catching up with him for sure. As we got into the last six minutes now. It's going to take him along here. I feel, oh, runs a bit wide, Thomas. Might give Vincey 
a little bit of breathing space, but he's going to be bang on him again, is Thomas. And I wouldn't be surprised if he gets this done by the time they reach the chicane, the second chicane, or through the first and into the second. Doesn't look close enough there. He's pushing, he's both pushing hard. Incy doing well to keep Thomas behind him at the moment. Right up there now. Of course, they're at mediums for Thomas and Incy. So the two medium boys there. The module also mediums. They're coming into play now at the back end of this race. Five minutes to go. I think the hards that Paul's got, I'm not sure they're going to be enough to hold off these boys. We'll see. Paul's led the entire race up to this point. Now, can he see it through and take victory? Or is he going to get done? Oh, and I can see a penalty on Paul. That's not, not going to help, is it? So he's going to have to go round and it's going to get done next time. So half a second penalty for Paul. That's going to just let these boys a bit closer as Thomas attacks into now. Here we go. This is what I've been calling for a while. Gets it done around the outside of Incy. Great move from Thomas. Second place for him then. Great move around the outside through the parabolica. He's going to be chasing down Paul for sure now. And with that penalty that Paul's got, I think Paul might be dropping a place. Roger is still there in fourth place. Trying his best to get old Grasshoppers in. He's going for a splash and dash. He didn't uh, calculate his field, but there's Roger. What can he do? Can he become part of that second and third place party? Put it against their passing, would you? Four minutes now. Oh, and it's his back ahead of Thomas, and this battle goes on. This is just going to allow Roger a bit closer if they're going to start fighting. Of course, this is working for Paul as well. If they keep fighting, that's going to slow them down. That's going to allow him to get away. And it's also an advantage of Wardrew. He's going to catch them. So, depends on how hard these two battle. Not a lot of fuel for Incy. I think he's going to have to come in, you know, for a splash and dash. That's going to hand Thomas and maybe even Wardrew then podium spots. Because there's no way he's getting another couple of laps out of that. He's not even getting one more lap out of that, so he's definitely in his NC pulls in the meantime. He's just got that penalty off, so now he's going to be into the clutches of these four, these three even. Take NC out of the equation now, because he's going to have to peel in and get some fuel. That's going to drop Thomas, or not drop him, but put him up into second spot. NC is going to stay to the right hand side. In he goes. Thanks very much, Thomas, into second place then, and then Wadru is going to into third, so he, here we are, the podium places at the moment. And I fancy with what, well, only two minutes and a bit left. Can Paul actually hold it out? I'm not sure, although he's still, at this moment of time, ahead. Dyson in fourth, Love Rocket in fifth, so Love Rocket's made a spot, uh, spot up on his teammate Mars who's in 6th place here he is in C7 Flash in 8th with Jerry right up behind him Jerry's going to have a go see if he can get that 8th place he kind of does he does can he keep it there oh little door to door almost running winded Flash that could have been disaster keeps it there though no, in the ninth place Molson 10th Chand in 11th Grasshopper and Alex having a bow Grasshopper up the inside, I think that was. Might have been Alex attacking on the outside, but 12th and 13th anyway. And then Chuck, we know, in 14th. But let's go back to this front because this is the lead. Oh, Paul's taking a lot there. There's them second and third. They're chasing him down. For sure they're chasing him down. Look at this. This is for the lead of the race with one minute left. What can we do? What's going to happen here? Oh, Paul. 
almost had a bit of a moment through, or did have a moment through the Parabolica. That is going to slow it down. Look at these two now. They're coming through. Paul's going to lose it. He's, he's led this race from the start into the last 30 seconds, and he's going to drop places here. He's going to stay to the right-hand side indicator to say to them, go on in, boys, you're faster than me. Drops in, so he drops to third, and the battle's on up top here. Roger's taking it though from Thomas after all that. So he did take Thomas. Oh, and Paul's running a bit wide, taking a lot of curve. That's going to slow him down. So that's that then from Paul. I think it's third place for him, but this battle here for the lead come down to at the end. The choice of tyre, Hards just weren't playing ball for Paul in the end. Did his best, but these two, as we know, battle hard on the medium tyres. Made a lot of fuel for either of these guys. Don't need any anyway, they only need to finish this lap because this is the final lap. And uh, what a race this has been for everybody. Oh, Thomas, I think he might have to settle for second. Wadru with the fastest lap as well, could get that at 139.313 around the Parabolica for the final time. And it looks like Wadru is going to take win number two here. He does. Congratulations to Wadru, two out of two tonight here at Monza. Thomas with the second place, well done. Paul will get that third. Dyson in fourth place. Closely followed by Love Rocket Rods in fifth. Good result for him. In seat, sixth place. Didn't quite work out in the end. He had to come in with that splash and dash, didn't he? Mars, he's run out. Literally going to roll it across in seventh, although he just got done by Jerry. Takes that seventh place. Mars does get an eighth, does he? Oh, just ahead of Flash, who gets that ninth. Big collision. Tenth for Grasshopper. Eleventh for Chan. Alex is twelfth. Molson thirteenth. Will be and Chuck's finished in 14th, didn't get another lap in. So there's your race two from Monza. Join me again for round seven next time. I think we're in France at Le Mans. And uh, I'll see you then, thanks for watching. And bye-bye uh, for now.